Mason Backman still in the uh, still alive for the uh, third place here at the NCAA's 2014. Uh, looking at that match with Joe Roth. First off, round of 12. Yeah. Mark Gray. Yeah. I believe I may have filmed a match last year at the Edinburgh Open with you and Mark Gray, and Mark Gray won. Yes. What's what's it like to get a little revenge on Mark Gray? Oh, I mean, he's a great wrestler, and we've gone back and forth our entire lives. I took a lot of beatings when we were little. Got a couple wins in high school and early college, and it's just a battle every time. So I don't really look at it as revenge as much as I do just going out and competing against some of the best guys in the country. Obviously excited to get a win, especially in round of 12, get on the podium. But as far as revenge goes, it's just... You know, I try to approach everyone the same. You game plan a little bit, but I try to go out and have fun. Peaks and valleys of your career. You know, I've looked at it. You, try, you tried 25 to start your freshman year. Couldn't do it. Went up to 33. Didn't really have the tournament. You uh, could have had it at 33 Absolutely. as a freshman. And then uh, now, you know, being an All-American, now the monkey's off your back. What do you got to do to come back and take third now the monkey's off your back? Uh, just keep wrestling. Keep scoring the next point. Uh, it's what's preached to us every day in the room. Keep attacking. If you're up 3-2, get a takedown to make it 5-2. Um, you know, finish every period on top. Just like I said, score the next point. Coach Santoro, Hughes, Dylan, Headley, uh, Buxton, everyone, every one of them preaches every day. Keep pushing. You know, if we do a 10 minute go and you score 35 points on the guy that go before that, score 36. What do you have to do between the quarterfinals and now to, you know, and, and the blood round to kind of get your head back in the game and realize, all right, you know, you lost a tough one there. You knew it was going to be tough. And then to, to, to recover, what would the coaches say anything to you or was that something you had to adjust yourself? Uh, a little bit of both. I mean, honestly, you hit the nail on the head. Tony Ramos is extremely good. He's a two-time national finalist, three-time All-American. So it's a guy, there's no shame in losing. And, you know, as much as it sucks, it hurts, absolutely. I came here to win. And, I, you know, that's not going to happen. But I, I wrestled full tilt for all seven minutes. And sometimes you just come up on the short end. You got to go get your head right. And, like I said, score the next point. Just keep wrestling. You guys